<laughs> I'm talking to you, asshole. Relax. Relax. Fuck. You. I have an emergency. Hey, asshole! God damn it, man. Don't do this. Oh, man, I want to do this. Hey. Me? Where am I? We don't know where we are. We all just woke up here one day. But we're all friends. Welcome. Friend? Don't listen to him. Please, I'm trying to talk to the new guy. He's a fucking liar. Okay, look, if you're gonna look keep to it, man, to shut him, the fuck up! Shut the fuck up! Shut the fuck up! You wanna fucking kill me! Stop it! I'm trying to read. Well, I might as well introduce you to everyone. The loud one is Hudson. He can be a little rude sometimes. Former army ranger. Started a little side business smuggling opium on his last tour in Afghanistan. One of his farmers was late to pay and well, Let's just say he doesn't worry about next year's harvest. He's a fucking liar. They couldn't prove nothing. That's about it for the talkative ones. Next to me is Diego. Navy SEAL, sniper. Six tours in Afghanistan, four in Iraq. Over 200 <laughs> confirmed kills. He's a goddamn traitor. All that killing went to his head. When his CO denied his request for release from duty, he shot him. <laughs> And down there is Sims. Now, we don't really know much about him. 
Well, maybe he'll tell us now that you're here. Hey, Sims, the new guy is here and wants to know what you did. Leave me alone. He'll come around. And down there, we don't really know who's in there. You know, one time, these two guards went in. They came out on stretchers. And my name is Taylor, and I'm so happy you're here. What's your name, friend? Jake. Everyone, meet Jake. Jake, meet everyone. I'm gonna tell our new friend Jake what you did? Jake just got here, we don't need to talk He's about. A genuine psychopath. That's not true. The government took him away from his family when he was a little baby? Grew up in some secret assassin program? No, no, no. My childhood was perfectly normal. <laughs> He's fucked up in the head, man, I'm telling you. Likes to cut people up. Keep little pieces of them for souvenirs. Liar, they're not souvenirs. It's much deeper than that. Government turned a blind eye until he started picking his own targets. Okay, <laughs> thank you, Hudson, yes, thank you. That's not true. I mean, it's not exactly true. So this is a military prison? It's a black site prison for special cases. People are too dangerous, with too many secrets. People the Department of Defense doesn't want the public to know about. Is that true? No one knows we're here. We don't even know where we are. friends? Well, I did have one friend. His name was Jeremy, but he wasn't real. I mean, he was real, but no one else could see him. We weren't allowed to have pets either. I mean, I did have this one pet. Quiet. Well, he was a bug. Shut up. What was that? Gunfire. Listen up! for the condition of these men. Andre! <laughs> these men are warriors! How dare you treat them without dignity! <laughs> Stupid <laughs> twat! Have you ever even seen combat? How dare you treat these men without dignity and respect! Apologies, gentlemen. Our intel failed to inform us that there was a prison here. My current mission doesn't concern you, or else I'd invite you to come play with us, as we could surely use men of your caliber. 
Colonel Ernie. Got yourself in a bit of a jam, mate? Hmm. I see you're staying busy. What are they calling you now? Jake. <laughs> That's so American. Six, this is Charlie. We're at the target area. Six is on his way. Well, it was good seeing you. Don't go anywhere, will you, gentlemen? Should be a good show. How do you know that guy? Former British SAS turned contractor. Damn. Met him in Islamabad. What was he doing there? Recruiting. Got it. Taylor? <laughs> huh. Taylor. Yeah, Jake? Give us the keys, man. Unlock the fucking door, Taylor. Come on, let us out. I swear to God, if you don't unlock this door right fucking now... Open the doors, come on, Taylor. Come on, we'll die in here! Back. Fuck you! Unlock the fucking door! Come on! Please! Please! Taylor, let us out of here. Look, I'm begging you. I need to see my daughter, man. Okay. I was gonna do it anyway. But I'm keeping this. Start in the cut now. Roger that. What do you want? I'm busy, what? Colonel Irving reports he's cutting the door, sir. Good. Good. <laughs> Very good. It's beautiful. <laughs> So what do we do now? He didn't smoke us when he had the chance. I said we make a break for it. And why should we listen to you? Because I didn't frag a guy in my own unit. Yeah, fuck you! you I'll kill you! Fuck. Stop, stop, listen. Listen, I know that man out there. I've seen the aftermath of what he's capable of. If we want to have any chance of surviving this, we need to get our heads on straight and start working together. Okay? I said we do some recon and we figure a way out of here. Unless you got any better ideas. Huh? No? Good, let's go. Fuck that. Let's go. We don't know what's in there. We're all a bunch of degenerate maniacs. For all we know, the guy in there is way worse than whatever the hell is out there. 
Well, if we don't let him out, he dies. So? What took you so long? Wait a minute. I do this thing where I go around and say everyone's story and name, but I don't think we have time for that right now, so can you just tell us your name? Vasquez. Let's go, let's go, 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 go. Looks like they've taken over the whole goddamn base. No cell service. Landlines are dead. All right. I'm gonna check out the roof. I'm going too. There's an open guard post north of here, and Irving seems to be focused on a building 200 meters south, so we should be clear. All right, let's move out. Wait, wait. What are they doing at that building 200 meters south? Breaking into it? Why? 200 meters due south. Get to the point. That's the control building for a long-range drone program. We have long-range drones? Not officially. That's why the program is here, at a black site. How do you know this? I used to work here. I was a pilot. Look, I wanted to be a regular pilot, but... So I became a drone pilot. There is a classified long-range drone program here. Why should we trust you? You're a goddamn criminal like the rest of us. I work for a terrorist hit squadron, okay? They ordered me to bomb a children's birthday party a terrorist was attending. I refused the order, so they decided to make an example out of me. Yes, I knew it. I knew I'd get your story eventually. One of those drones is fitted with a 50 megaton nuclear bomb. <laughs> it's in the air 24-7. The control of that drone is in that building. So they're about to have control of a nuclear bomb. That's what I'm saying. Wait, but the power's out. All critical systems have backup generators. Oh, fuck this. Where is everybody? Why aren't they they're decommissioning the base. It's running on a skeleton crew. All right, but they have to have some sort of backup plan. For there this is guy. a quick response force. Well, great, let them deal with it. But we are in the middle of nowhere. They're at least two hours away. Look, if we can pull this off, I guarantee every one of us will get a pardon. I'm in. I'll help. When this is over, I'm going back here. <laughs> what? Some of us deserve to be here for what we did. You're loco, S.A. For a full pardon, you're goddamn right, I'm in. Can I be in? I'm in. I can be in, right? What about you? My daughter's waiting for me. We get through this. You won't have to raise her like a fugitive. All right. Oh, man. Yes! This is awesome! Okay. What do we do now? Shit. What's wrong? It's 
two of them 25 meters away. Can I see? Shut up and stay low. We've got three men down, over. Find who's ever responsible! Copy, Six.
Jesus. Oh. Hey, boy. You a big son of a bitch, ain't you? <laughs> you want something, don't you? I can tell. You want to do this right? Do it right, big boy. Come on, yeah. There you go. Oh, damn. Damn, you a big son of a bitch. Yeah, throw those. Throw those fists. Throw it. Throw it, big boy. You big. Big. Big and fucking dumb. Take this. No, I don't really want to. Take it, you might need it. Safety is here. Do not flip it until you need it. If you see a bad guy, you point and shoot, okay? Okay. Don't do that. They'll shoot your dick off. to move faster. We're going as fast as we can, sir. Well, I want it to go even faster. Is that understood? Yes, sir. Now get to work. All right. If we switch to an alt frequency, we can communicate. Check, check. Check, check. Great. So we can talk now. There's a button at the command center. It allows another base to take control of the drones. It's just a button. They needed a physical switch to make it hacker-proof. If we push that button, a pilot at another base can't assume control of the drones. Okay, so all we gotta do is push a button. We also have to push one on the drone control panel. And we have to push it within 30 seconds of each other. Are you kidding me? All right, so we gotta fight our way into the drone control building while at the same time fighting our way into the command center building on the other side of the base push the two buttons simultaneously to prevent nuclear holocaust. Yes. People say I'm crazy. I'm not, by the way. But this is crazy. No, no, this is bullshit. I said I was gonna help, but this is turning into a suicide mission. You know what? We all got into this at some point because we want to be a part of something bigger than ourselves. We wanted to make a difference. This is not about some pardon. If we don't do this, what kind of father would I be knowing that I could have done something to stop this? And we've all been in bad spots before. And this is what they trained us for. And you guys can do whatever you want to do. I'm going to work. God damn it. All right. Hudson, Taylor, you guys find that remote switch. It's in the building down there. Better not do anything weird. Me? Let's go. Diego, find some high ground, give him cover. Three of us. We're gonna take that control room. Oh. I don't know yet. Actually, there's a basement access tunnel that takes us right into the control room. Judging by the fact that these guys have spent so much time cutting through it, I doubt they know anything about it. Finally, some good news out of you.
we're almost through. Killer, easy. We could use some help over here. <laughs> 